Teachers throughout the state of Indiana believe that schools aren't getting enough public funding. They are asking state legislators to rethink the way they budget public education. Star City's Nina Slosberg has more on what local school districts are doing to make sure their message is heard. Starting at 7 in the morning on Wednesday, April 10th, teachers from school districts in Sipicanoo County are going to gather outside of their buildings to send a unified message to Indiana state lawmakers. The Indiana State Teachers Association says recent polls show that 70% of Hoosiers, regardless of their political affiliation, will have the same answer to this question. Do you feel like these schools get enough funding or the proper funding they need? No. I'm a former teacher and I know what it's like. Barbara Stansberry, who is picking up her grandson from school, says when she was a teacher, she didn't always have all the resources her class needed. A lot of times you had to spend your own money to get things done. This is why West Lafayette Education Association co-presidents Andy Hipsher and Mary Dell Forbes will be standing outside of their buildings on April 10th. We'd like them to invest more in our future. That would be our students. And uh, together we're going to, uh, you know, make that known. The day before the walk-in, Forbes and Hipsher will be joining teachers across Indiana, visiting legislators in person at the State House. Ask for their continued support and, and also ask them to have the conviction to stand up to their colleagues and say it is time uh, to stop paying lip service here and to actually fund public education in a meaningful way. Forbes says she wants state legislators to really look at how they're spending the dollars they already set aside for public education. Uh, testing, $96 million being spent uh, just to say who is uh, on par scholastically. We could tell you in five minutes. We'd like to take some of that money and uh, put it into the classroom, both in terms of facilities and the curriculum. She says all people in the community are welcome to join them in West Lafayette. We'd love to have a huge showing you know, uh, line the sidewalk here, line the grass, and uh, let's show our support not only for our fellow teachers, but show everybody what a community we are and how we care about education. West Lafayette Mayor John Dennis and Superintendent Rocky Killiam will be joining these teachers in support. Reporting live, Nina Slosberg, Star City News.